Saturday morning. Make sure you get your breakfast in. We're going to get, before your breakfast though, you need to get your workout on, okay? So, we're going to hit you right here, right now. Four rounds in, on, on the warm up here. Pretty long, okay? But you're going to need it though. So, you got a quick hand round. Minute number one, high knees. Entire minute. Keep going at it. Minute number two, reverse lunges here. Stepping back, making sure you're still maintaining that 90 90 zone. Minute number three, we have strict presses with your burrito. Squeezing the quad, squeezing the butt, pressing overhead. Ooh, nice finish there. And you're going to maintain that for the entire duration. If you get tired, you can press the burrito at your waist, rest a couple seconds, then start going back at it again. Now, once you finish minute number three, you're starting back all over again. So make sure you're doing that. Minute number one, minute number two, minute number three, four times. Okay? Now, no strength today. That is going to get you plenty prepared for what we have in store for you. This is an eight minute AMRAP, and you're going to rest six minutes and you have a four minute AMRAP. Now, this is made to be fast and furious, okay? So I want you to get after it. You start with a blistering pace and end with as close to what looks like a blistering pace as possible. So, on the eight minute AMRAP, we have 10 single arm power snatches. So you're going to be alternating your right and left arms here. Five with your left, five with your right. So you alternate every single repetition with that dumbbell. Then, for the cardiovascular portion of this, you're going to be doing some burrito taps with your feet. So we hit 30 total taps. Just like that. You can slow that down. You can speed that up. If you're able to keep that fast pace, do it. If you need to tap it and make it a little slower for the impact of your ankles, do that as well. You're going to complete as many rounds in eight minutes as you can. Then we're going to rest six minutes. Then we have half the half the AMRAP as the first. We have a four minute AMRAP. We're doing three single arm dumbbell snatches each arm, and then we're going to complete 15 total taps with your feet there. As you're going, making sure you maintain a flat back as you're doing that dumbbell snatch, going right back into those taps there to slow it down if you need to. But I want you to keep going and push the pace on this. This is a fun one, nice and fast. you got a nice rest in the middle. Enjoy it. And then with a the cool down, guys, you got a pigeon stretch here, two minutes on each side. If you can, okay, if you're super flexible, this is awesome, then you want to try to get it to where your, sh your shin is as vertical or in the center of the body as possible. It's kind of perpendicular to it. Get nice and flat here. Make sure your back leg is straight and push behind you there and just relax and enjoy it. Doing two minutes on each side. And then the last one will be couch stretch. One minute or you can do it standing as well. If you have a pillow and you're doing this at home, make sure that you cushion that knee Enjoy this one. I think you're going to love it. We planned it just for you. Have a seven.